Hello watch fans, Beth Year Watches here and in this rather grubby watch with some numbers on the back, it's a mapping and web case for a mapping and web watch. We've got some paperwork for it as well, it's dated 1981 but the case back is quite clearly engraved for 1980 so maybe this was the expiry date and also notice they've spelt their own name incorrectly as well as this giving you all the details of what batteries this takes when it doesn't take batteries. We're going to say this is from 1980 because that is a lot more concrete. You can actually see the little work in progress bits. I think this has been hand engraved and you can see the guidelines in that. I don't know what any of this means apart from it was, it was somewhere for 25 years. Gold plated case, gold in 1980 was hugely expensive. But Mapping and Web did put an ETA automatic movement in this with quick set date. So take it to the first position. Excellent if you've got more than one watch in your collection. Overall condition is very good. There is some wear to the outer edge of the crown, but the actual lugs are pretty damn fine. The strap is new, which is why it doesn't fit particularly well in the case. I think they used to use a thinner strap, so it doesn't fit particularly well in that box. But it's nice to have the box with the watch. Not an expensive piece, but perfectly wearable and excellent if you want a watch from 1980 and don't want a quartz. Most of the ones you'll find will be quartz because that was most of what sold. You'll see more on this watch if you click the link in the pinned comment or head by to Berthier Watches. That will take you straight to our website. And if you like cool vintage watches, why not hit subscribe? You never know what we'll have next. Thanks for watching.